Hello my dear children welcome back to my channel this is Vidya Prabhu your math teacher here class 10 NCERT chapter number 2 polynomial exercise number 2.2 find the zeros of the polynomial and verify the relationship between the zeros and their coefficient subdivision number 5 t square minus 15 for the given quadratic polynomial we need to find out the zeros of the polynomial the given quadratic polynomial t square minus 15 here we have only two terms and that cons and the term. when you observe with the general form ax square plus bx plus c here we have only x square term and the constant term and the x term is missing so we can find only the first term and the last term so directly you can equate them to zero to find out these zeros of the polynomial t square is equal to taking minus 15 to the other side so we'll get plus 15 so t equal to square root of 15 since it is plus or minus root 15 so t value will be minus root 15 and t takes the value minus root 15 alpha equal to minus root 15 and beta equal to plus root 15 next we need to find out the coefficient of the t square term the coefficient of t square a equal to 1 and b equal to we don't find any t term so constant b will be 0 and the constant term c will be minus 15 we need to verify the relationship between the alpha beta and the coefficient of the polynomial i can take this as alpha and i can take plus root 15 as beta first thing we need to verify what is sum of the zeros that is alpha plus beta equal to minus b by a so minus root 15 plus beta root 15 equal to minus b value 0 dividing by a value 1 Plus root 15 minus root 15 will become zero on the left hand side. Zero by anything is zero. Hence, we forget that left hand side is equal to right hand side. We need to verify the second thing, that is product of the zeros. Alpha, beta equal to c by a. Multiply. Minus root 15 into plus root 15 equal to c value minus 15 dividing by a value 1. Minus root 15 into plus root 15 is 15 minus 15 equal to minus 15. LHS is equal to RHS. Hence, we have verified the relationship between the zeros of the polynomial and their coefficient. Let me explain the problem again. Subdivision number five, t square minus 15. The polynomial expressions have the first term and the last term. Here we don't find t term, so I can directly equate them to zero, finding the value of t. T equal to plus or minus root 15, which means Alpha equal to minus root 15 and beta equal to plus root 15. Now we need to write the coefficient a, b, and c. A the coefficient of t square one and b the coefficient of t since it is missing. The term b will be zero. C equal to the constant term minus 15. Verify the relationship. First thing sum of the zeros. Alpha plus beta equal to minus b by a. Alpha minus root 15, beta plus root 15, minus of 0 by 1. Left hand side is equal to right hand side. Second thing we need to verify the product of these zeros. We need to multiply alpha into beta equal to c by a minus root 15 into plus root 15 equal to the c minus 15 by a value 1. Root 15 into root 15, 15 plus into minus minus. So both the sides we are getting minus 15 into minus sorry minus 15 minus 15. That LHS is equal to RHS. Hence verified. Thank you. Thank you for watching my video.